Heather. Uh, I was going to send this to you on Facebook, but Facebook video is not working. So I'm just going to make this on the YouTube account and then take it down once you see the message. This is for you and whoever else needs it. So as far as green screen goes, you could use this. This is cloth. I just got this yesterday. I haven't used it. Um, if you don't have cloth, you can use green poster board. And if you don't want to spend money on that, you could do green screen without actually using any green at all. I've actually used it with glue before. Um, so you could make a green screen if there's no green in the background. Just make sure there's some other colors in there like red or blue or try doing green, I guess. So if you have a Mac, if you have iMovie, if you have videos in a picture set in iMovie, you're going to want to open iMovie up. And once it's open, you're going to want to click on iMovie again, top left corner, and click on Preferences. Then you're going to want to click on Show Advanced Tools. It's going to say, basically it means it's going to give you the advanced options when you click on something to enable dual mode, toolbar, keyword, uh, cutaway, picture in picture, green screen, additional uh, replace modes, and chapter markers. So that means when you play around with iMovie later on and you click on something, it's going to pop up with a window saying, do you want to do green screen or picture in picture? That's all it says. For green screen, you're going to want to find the media you want as the background and drag it to the editing place. It should be on the, uh, the top left corner or top left corner. Uh, then you're going to want to find the media you want to go over that background. So just click it and drag it over the background clip. The screen is going to pop up. It's going to say, do you want to do picture in picture, cutaway mode, green screen? Click on green screen. Like I said, you could also do this with videos that don't have any green in them. All you have to do is double click the video that you want in the front that doesn't have any green in it. A window is going to pop up. The middle on the top of the video, the window, should be something that says video. On the right side it says audio, but click video. And then it's going to give you a page that says, you know, you can play with expo exposure, brightness, contrast, saturation. The, I want to say 80 to 90% of the time you're going to use red, green, and blue gain to kind of mess with the... Uh, the green screen thing, so you can do it if you don't have green in the background. Um, but hopefully you guys can do that. You can do it with pictures. I've tried it with pictures. Um, I don't know if I said it before, but I'm actually editing a video for class that will be up tomorrow. And I use green screen and I use non-green screen, so I'll show you what it looks like later on. Um, yeah, if, if you guys can't do that, then I guess I'll just have to go down and videotape and put together a video for you guys. But yeah, just thought I would give you guys uh, tips and advice. This is a really long video, I'm sorry. But yeah, I guess I'll talk to you later. Okay, bye.